Hey, it's Blake's Nature Live. It's time to go pick some punk. I was about to say pick some pumpkins. Let's pick some papayas. They taste sweeter. Look at that. I got one on here that's really ripe. That one I'll pick tomorrow, and this one needs to be picked today. Look how red that is. Sorry, little spider. We'll twist it off. Without hurting the fruit. There we go. Look at this. How often do you see it this red? Look how ripe that is. So let's put this one over here. And we're going to pick the first papaya fruit off this other papaya tree. Can't get no better than this right from your backyard. Alright, now these are got some fungal issues. So I'll probably go ahead and pick them both. See, I didn't spray enough copper on here. So. Alright, we'll probably pick this one. This one's got a little uglier on it. It had some bugs attack it. But I want to try it. There you go. We'll show you in a little bit what it looks like inside. Alright, so this papaya is from Blake's tree. I think already from this tree, we had some last year, I think. We had one yeah, we last had a, year. a few last year. And but this year's we've had a few this year. This year it put, it's putting off a lot of papayas. You can see it was really ripe. You can see where the, uh, when I twisted it, a piece came out. So I'm going to cut off here and here and then half. That sounds good. That way when we take the skin off, it's sitting on a flat base. Probably can try that. Ooh, this smells really good. Yeah, when it's super ripe, it's real sweet. It smells like, like papaya smoothie. You can smell it through the skin too. You know what's crazy? I'm having an issue with that fungus on the skin of the fruit. That's why it's so hard to get it this ripe. Yeah, it starts eating in the fruit. Yeah. If you were to give us a try, baby. Cut it in half. I'll keep these seeds, keep growing them out. Isn't it so soft? This knife, this knife helps too. It feels like I'm cutting through butter. All right, you guys, time for the big reveal. If I could separate it. Ooh, it's a good sign with a lot of seeds. That means a lot of flavor. Oh, while you're there. You need a spoon? Yes, you will. Take out these seeds. about what's underneath my nails. Yeah. Easier this way anyway. Just, if you could, put them in this bag. I'll save them. What? You know, I like this pulp that holds the seeds together. It's sweet, isn't it? I don't know why I like that stringiness. The seeds actually taste like a like pepper. Like black pepper. So like on Sundays, my when I was little, my dad would open these up. Oh, but that was awesome. So when we would wake up before going to church, you'd have some healthy have some. meals. And I love like this like string fiber. So I've I've never really. What's this? The fiber taste like? I've never really tried it. Um, I just always when I try it, I'm eating the seed too. So I'm tasting all this pepper. Not pepper, like a pepper seasoning. Here, I'll cut you a piece where you could try like the. I mean, it makes sense. It's probably sweeter there. I don't know. It's just something about like the texture of it that I. We'll like. let you try one side first and tell us what you think. It's very sweet, very juicy. It sounds like a papaya. To Grow more it of. has the color like a papaya should have. Real dark. Real dark orange. Um, this is very sweet. It is very good. This one tastes like the one we had last year. It does. Yeah. I know how to. I know how to get them like this. So you have to give it time. Like you could even see like the one you had cut for your brother and 
and his family. Like it needed another week. Yeah, and like the skin was a little bit more tough. And more like more yellow than orange. Yeah, because it has to be this orange color for it to be tasting. Really and you see it like this. That is prime sweetness. This uh, darker orange, and then you see it's all orange. Yeah. But the issue is, I'm having is the fungus is attacking it. Yeah. So you could see like this part right here. All, this side of the fruit is gonna taste really sweet. Yo. But the whole fruit it this doesn't is, really have much red orange here. But where I cut, it's very sweet. This is pressed. Then you imagine having yeah. this for people to sample to and buy the fruit. And it's very juicy, which is great. Like, I don't know if you, the picture will pick it up, but even like the knife is like real wet from the juice. And you can't find this at the store of fruits like this. Yeah, you not where to, we live. Well, you're probably down south, but yeah. I haven't had one so good since I've been growing them myself. Yeah, I think one time we had luck buying it from the store. Which was great. I actually think but it was after that. No, was I think it was from the Indian uh, her store at her little market. And I actually these are the ones from her that seed from the fruit. Your mom and them would love this. Yeah, they would love. They this. didn't get to try it as rough as it should have yeah. been because I had to pick it a little earlier when we brought it. But it's really good. Well, when it's at this stage. Any movement on it can bruise it. Mm -hmm. So hard to to move. Isn't that amazing? Yes. I'm about to feed the camera. Mm-hmm. It's really mm. good. Well, about you can is see, like it's so juicy. Like it's like dripping and stuff. It's like getting all over the. Let's onyx see. Let's let Onyx wants. try it. Let's let Onyx try it. Oh. Right she approves. Two thumbs up. Two thumbs up and two paws up. All right. Two paws up. We'll catch you later. We're gonna keep finish enjoying these.